Welcome back, crypto enthusiasts. Today, we're diving into some of the hottest altcoins making waves in the digital world. My name is Dan. Let's get started. Lately, all eyes have been on WorldCoin, pun intended. Because of its unique way of user identification, this is a blockchain-based digital platform that aims to make access to global finance easy for everyone. To use the ecosystem, one has to scan their eyes using special bowling ball-sized orb devices. This proof of personhood should help people with proving that they aren't robots while remaining anonymous. Each new user receives one WLD after verification. Alex Blania and Sam Altman, who is OpenAI CEO, are the founders. Some experts, including Vitalik Buterin, raise questions about the privacy and security of giving biometrics data to a centralized company. Now, other investors, including Andreessen Horowitz, support the project. Despite the mixed reviews, over 2 million people from 34 different countries have signed up. The company was even ordered to suspend its eyeball scanning activity in Kenya by its government on August 2nd because there were concerns about public potential safety. Basically, thousands of Kenyans were waiting in line at registration centers to get the currency worth about $49. The project's white paper states that over the next 15 years, a total of 10 billion WLD will be issued. With the current circulating supply is about 140 million tokens, only 1.4% of the total planned supply is out. Overall, seems like WorldCoin is a project worth keeping an eye on. The Libra protocol wants to make cryptocurrency more stable using liquid staking derivatives. The main goal is to create a stable digital coin called EUSD, which offers interest to the token holders from collateralized liquid staking tokens. In short, they receive a stable income in liquid stake Ether of approximately 5%. In July, they tested a new version of their system on a special network, Arbitrum's Guerli. The team wants to attract more high-frequency traders and other decentralized finance users with its products. With the V2 upgrade, users can leverage Rocket Pool, Binance, and Swell's liquid staking tokens as collateral to generate EUSD. The tested rollout seems to have attracted investors' interest because since that happened, the market capitalization of the USD has surged 152% to $198 million as investors deposit staking tokens to mint USD. What is more is that the project is coming close to $400 million in total value locked, a 108% increase in July. Omega Network is a decentralized open source payment technology that allows using electronic devices to make protocol level contributions and receive rewards. Even a phone is enough to participate because the project wants to make mining crypto accessible to everyone. Omega operates as a proof of networking social chain. By incorporating cryptographic technology, a highly scalable consensus algorithm, and user-friendly design, the company's mission is to empower users worldwide to communicate, share information, make payments, and create decentralized applications. Omega Network has a lightweight platform that makes mining cost-effective. It offers dApps, NFTs, and staking Omega Network tokens, among some other functions. Investors might find interesting the fact that Omega has a lot of plans. For example, the team wants to launch an NFT marketplace, create a governance and voting system, introduce a metaverse, among many other things. What's more is that the project boasts partnerships with companies such as Bybit, CoinMarketCap, and CoinGecko. BarnBridge is a project that helps with managing different kinds of risks connected to using DeFi, like inflation and unpredictable changes in interest rates. For example, one of their tools called Smart Yield takes the money you make from lending on platforms like Aave and divides it into parts with varying levels of risk. 
Another feature, Smart Exposure, lets you automatically keep a certain balance between two types of digital tokens, ERC20 tokens, which might be more profitable than just buying and holding them, depending on what's happening in the market. If you have bond tokens, for example, you can also have a say in how Barn Bridge is managed through their DAO protocol. The project lists certain companies as its friends. Such investment companies include 4RC, Dialectic, Dragonfly, and Parafy Capital, as well as the founders of Ave and Synthetics. Optimism is a layer 2 scaling solution for Ethereum. It's designed to improve the speed and reduce the cost of transactions on the Ethereum network. Optimism uses a technology called optimistic rollups, which allows it to bundle many transactions together, making the network more efficient. This technology aims to enhance the user experience by providing faster confirmations and lower fees compared to directly using the Ethereum mainnet. It's a promising development for addressing Ethereum scalability challenges and improving the overall efficiency of the network. Recently, Optimism grew in price because it was announced that Coinbase's Layer 2 blockchain base will be launched on August 9, 2023. This Layer 2 is built with the OP stack and should increase user activity for Optimism. Before that, in June, the system went through the Bedrock upgrade, which also had a positive effect on the number of transactions. In light of these events, one might say that the project Optimism has quite an optimistic outlook. Casper is a proof-of-work cryptocurrency that utilizes the GhostDAG protocol. Unlike traditional blockchains, GhostDAG doesn't orphan blocks that are created in parallel, but rather it allows them to coexist and orders them in consensus. This allows for secure work while maintaining very high block rates, which at the moment, the speed is one block per second, but the aim is 10 blocks per second or even higher. Caspo was envisioned by R&D company DAG Labs and Polychain as an investor. However, now Caspo is a community project. It's open source and doesn't have central governance. And the founder is Jonathan Sompolinski, who studied at Harvard University. Caspa's fair launch happened on November 7th, 2021 meaning there was no pre-mined or allocated coins. Caspa also includes a unique monetary policy that decreases emissions geometrically over time based on the 12-note scale of music. The block reward is halved once per year and smoothly, but every month the block reward is reduced. The initial block reward is the frequency of note A4, and every average year is hence called an octave. In June 2023, the price of Caspa started to experience a substantial upward trend because of the system's upgrade to the speed of 10 blocks per second on its testnet. On June 6th, the asset's price was 0.015 cents, whereas at its peak in July 8th, it reached 0.05 cents. These are the most exciting altcoins which we wanted to discuss at this time. Do you know of any other noteworthy projects? Tell us in the comments below and please leave a like and subscribe if you like this format.